So moving down the list here, Grain of Free Fire. It looks like this one actually has a tiny bit of twist traction compared to the other mobile games, which still isn't a lot. 1.19 billion hours watched. Is this surprising to you guys that it's actually a fairly bigger game on YouTube than what it is Facebook gaming? Yes, it's not surprising it is. at all. Uh, we, you, we went, you're not surprised that it's on bigger on YouTube. Please share your knowledge with us. Yeah. Why? <laughs> well, we went through the entire uh, 2020 what report from YouTube from their head of gaming, and they they showed how much growth Arena Free Fire had on that platform. It is literally detonating with with growth. Like I've never seen a game grow more on a platform. This detonating. this amount that you see this red bar right now. This is going to be massive within the next year. And this 1 billion number is going to be much higher, if not double, maybe even within the next year. If Green of Free Fire, like it has a it has a good shot on this list of being the number one uh, live stream viewed game. Um, however, they were also incorporating, I believe, non-live viewership into that as well, which we would have to consider. So if we take a look at the search interest then on that one, comparative to, I guess, GTA 5, it has... Although it hasn't really, it hasn't really grown in the past 12 months. So we'd have to kind of compare like what we're seeing here. And maybe, maybe I'm doing I think if you type in the term free fire. Yeah, I think it's because I'm looking at Type free in the word fire. free fire up top and watch what happens. Watch the magic. Free fire. Let's do one no, word. Two, two separate words. Two separate words. Okay. One, two separate. Let's see what happens. A boom shakalaka. Ah, there we go. Look That's how why. tiny GTA is in comparison to free fire. And look how it trended up in 2020. Brief, look at your teeny little arrow. Man, that's embarrassing. Um, but <laughs> I'm not, I got less thick. I don't know what happened. Oh, <laughs> I promise it's bigger than that. So look at how big this is compared to GTA 5. Like this game, Garena Free Fire. I mean, you want to talk about a top game for 2021? You look at the YouTube search interest. If you just went into any freaking niche on this game at all on YouTube, you could absolutely grow. So dissect one element of the game become a master of that one element of the game for Free Fire. Maybe that's just covering the skins. Maybe that's just talking about the upcoming sales and what's happening in the store. Maybe it's just one specific mode in the game. Double down and become a master of one element of Free Fire and capitalize on this insane amount of search interest to this game. It dwarfs GTA 5, guys. One of the top games in the world. That teeny little red line down there is GTA 5. Do you see how much bigger Free Fire is than that? Do you see why? My predictions, I'm going just ape when I'm talking about the freaking possibilities of mobile gaming. It is dwarfing the juggernauts of gaming today. Free Fire, to me, is an indication of the future trends where everybody in the entire world has phones, especially international markets, and Free Fire shows the explosive case capabilities of these games to completely dominate platforms like YouTube. Ross, what yep. are your thoughts on Free Fire as an indication of the explosive growth of future mobile titles as we move into 2021 and beyond. Well, it's a huge sign. This is obviously the trend. We've been talking about this for the entire time we've ever been doing this podcast about how mobile gaming is moving in the future for not only uh, just regular gamers and players, but streamers as well. So if you're not paying attention to games like Grana Free Fire, uh, you're really, really missing a huge opportunity. And we can sit there and talk about blue in the face. Well, I don't like mobile games and stuff like that. Well, oh, if you really be scared. successful, you should probably learn to like them and maybe consider moving into the avenue of mobile gaming. Everything that they just said by pulling up the trends, looking at this chart proves that that's the direction it's going. So maybe stop, take a listen and figure out a way to, you know, kind of exploit that going forward into the future, especially if you're on Facebook gaming, it looks like. Moving on, uh, we gotta move quick through the rest of these. So Minecraft. that's a check mark. We, we think that, that game is good. Gaming creators, really quick, before you do anything else, enter to win our gaming creator bundle sweepstakes, $1,100 in gear, we're giving away for $0. Link in the description below. It includes this exact audio setup you hear me on right now. It's the one we use on the podcast every single day. If you want to sound this good, this is live, by the way. This is not an edited video. This is the way it actually sounds. Let me just show you the bundle. It's freaking amazing. The bundle includes this microphone shock mount and boom arm. Plus, it includes the Rodecaster Pro Mixer, which is arguably the best creator mixer on the market. Plus, our friends at TubeBuddy threw in a TubeBuddy Legend license if you want to help grow that YouTube channel faster. Plus, 
Our friends over at Restream threw in a Restream license if you wanna to stream to multiple platforms at the same time and grow your stream faster. Road hookup, TubeBuddy hookup, Restream hookup. They all just wanted to give you guys gear to help you succeed and software to help you succeed for free. So here you go. Link in the description below. Enter for your chance to win. I wish you the best of luck and I hope that you guys can maybe pick this package up and increase your quality and increase your chances of growing faster with the tools and gear that we use every single day to grow and hopefully you can use to grow as well. Link below, go do it. Thank you.